Hey guys, so if you're trying to shop for more sustainable and ethically minded clothing brands, I'm gonna show you how I find them online and give you some tips for doing research. The first thing I recommend is looking for more conscious stores in your city or area. Search for some combination of sustainable fashion your city, and then you can try different words like eco-friendly, ethical, fair trade, organic, locally made, vegan. You can also try substituting fashion for clothing, designers, stores, brands, boutiques, or markets, or of course, any words or translations in the common language where you live. A lot of these combinations will give you similar results, but it's good to go back and try quite a few different ones because you can sometimes get different hits. If you can't find anything in your city or want to shop online, then you can switch out your city name for your country to find brands that manufacture in or ship to your country. So I'm going to search Ethical Clothing Canada. You will likely get results that are brands, online stores that carry multiple brands, or articles. I think articles can be great because they often list multiple brands, but do check the date it was published to make sure it's not too old. Like I've mentioned in previous videos, it's really good to know what your priorities are before starting to shop. So if there's anything more specific that you're looking for, include that in your search. Okay, so when you're on a brand's website, the first thing I do is find the about section. Now this can be called various things and it's usually at the top or the very bottom of the website. I read through that and I definitely wanna see something about their sustainable or ethical policies. Some websites might have these on separate pages, so also look for links that say something like ethics, social responsibility, or sustainability. And when you're reading, if there are any terms or things you don't understand, Google them to find out more information. And when I'm reading through these, what I really wanna see, what gives me confidence in a brand, is lots of information and specific versus vague general statements. PeopleTree is a really great example of this and one of the most informative websites I've seen with details about their farmers, manufacturers, and materials. Now, a lot of websites don't go this in depth, but just saying something like, we care about our factory workers, I don't think is good enough. For example, statements like, we do not allow forced overtime, or we only use low impact, non-toxic dyes, or anything else that demonstrates they're committed to more responsible practices and policies. I think a company that clearly states, we do not do X, Y, Z, or these are the things that we're working on is really important because statements like that not only make the company more accountable, but it shows that they're more knowledgeable about their supply chain and that they have actual policies and programs in place instead of just saying general things like, we care about the environment. When you are researching brands, don't be afraid to ask questions if there's something that you don't understand or would like more clarification on. It's really quick and easy to send an email or you can even contact them through social media. Some websites even encourage you to ask questions, which I think is really good and shows that they're willing to be open and honest. And the response that you'll get from companies will tell you a lot about how transparent they are and how well they know their supply chain. Something else that's really good to look for is certifications. These can be fair trade, organic, or others. There are lots of them, and I will link some information on them below. Certifications ensure that a product meets a certain set of criteria. A common, and I think one of the best organic certifications is GOTS or G-O-T-S. It stands for Global Organic Textile Standard, and it looks like this, a green circle with a little white shirt. The two common fair trade certifications are this one and this one. There are also certifications for other things and country specific ones. This website is a really good reference and I will link it below. But I do wanna note that just because a product is not certified doesn't mean that it's not organic or fair trade or other things that it claims to be. Sometimes small businesses and especially independent designers might not be able to afford the certification or it might just not make sense for them to get certified, but their products could still be very ethical and sustainable. Now, instead of buying directly from brands, you can also buy from online stores that carry multiple brands. And this usually gives you a wider selection and more variety. Again, first read the About Us or any information on their ethics and sustainability to see if it aligns with your values. But how I mentioned that it's good to look for specific examples with clothing brands, stores will generally be a little bit more vague because it's harder to make very clear definitive statements when you have multiple brands and are not directly in charge of the supply chain and manufacturing. However, they should list or talk about the different things they look for from their brands and the criteria they have for the products they carry. When you find brands or stores you like, even if they don't have the item you're looking for, I really recommend saving the websites in a bookmark folder. It will make shopping in the future much easier because you can just go through your bookmarks. 
Another good way to find brands and stores is through online directories. Some of these will even have filters for different criteria. I will link to some different ones below, and if you have any good directories or resources for finding brands, please leave them in the comments. Okay, so I hope you found this helpful. It might sound like a lot to read and think about, but honestly, it probably takes the same amount of time as driving to your nearest mall. To kind of summarize, I think the most important things are to just read what companies are saying and trust your gut. If they don't sound serious or committed, they probably aren't. To ask questions, anything you want to know more about or a better explanation of, ask them and be open and willing to compromise. You might not find that exact v-neck dark purple maxi dress that you saw online made locally out of organic cotton, but you might be able to find something similar or that would serve the same purpose. So if you have any questions about researching or shopping for ethical brands, please let me know in the comments and I will try my best to help you out. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.